All right, guys, I've been procrastinating enough. Today is the day. I'm about to go finally upgrade the tires on the Trek Marlin 6. So we got all my bikes right here. Don't mind the mess, but the Trek Marlin 6, it's time for her to go in today and get back into commission. Man, I feel bad. The tire's been flat for so long, but it's time to take you in today, and it's time to get you back on the trails ripping. But I am going to take off the dork disc. Since they got to replace the wheels anyway, I'm going to just have them take it off because I know you guys give me a hard time about it. <laughs> and then... I'm gonna finally get these pedals switched out. All right, guys, we made it to Wheat Ridge Cyclery. Let's get this Marlin out and see what they got in there for us. I'd probably say 2.4 would be the widest tire, but the, the service guys would definitely be able to tell you that. But a 2.4 is probably the widest you can on the rear. That's what I was actually hoping that I can get on here. <laughs> I mean, you might be able to do a 2.3 in the back. Oh, okay. Potentially. And um, in the front, you probably do a 2.4. But yeah, it's, uh, and the rear, you can do, I mean, 2.3 is easy. Okay. Four. So you can do aggressors, high rollers, minions, whatever. Able to climb more out of the back. I would do an aggressor 2.3 rear, probably a DHF front. Okay. That's probably the route I would go, even on a hardtail. Yeah, okay, I'll go that route then. Was, do you think those will fit on those, the rims I already have? Okay. How's it going today? Yeah, I was looking for some pedals. Some pedals are gonna oh, yeah. be on, on this wall over here. Okay, my, my bike is like the, the colors are neon green, but I'm just like, I'm not sure if, the, I don't know if I should get this or a different color. Do you have the bike with you? Yeah, it's actually getting some tires thrown on it right now. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, I wonder if I should get yellow, I don't know. Uh, I guess I'll do green, let's go see. I'm gonna go look real quick. Yeah, definitely go. <laughs> let's see if they match the bike at all. I don't think they will, but they might be close enough. Oh, wow, yeah, that's way off. All right, so the green didn't really match that good, so we gonna get the black. I think better black would be a lot nicer. Well, what kind of bike do you ride? This uh, hardtail? That's sick. <laughs> Moots, is that the name of the bike, Moots? That's cool. That's a sick bike, I like that. You ride hardtails too. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any full suspension bikes. I got a full suspension, but I don't know why I like hardtails better. I just have more fun on them for some reason. Oh yeah, I had plenty of room up there. I could have put a 2.6 up there. Hey guys, we got the, the new tires on here. It already feels legit. This is crazy. It feels, the bike actually feels bigger now for some reason. <laughs> Yeah, this is sick. <laughs> I cannot wait to take this out on the trail and see what it feels like. It actually looks like a real mountain bike now. I'm gonna go down this little stair set over here just to see what it feels like. Let's see. Oh yeah, that's sick. <laughs> Can I do wheelies with this tire? With these tires? Let's see. See if I can do wheelies with these tires. I cannot wait to shred on these things. Ah, oh, it's, it's a little weird doing wheelies. Oh yeah, I can do a wheelie with them. Can we ride up the stairs with them? Yep. Yep, I like these tires. I just hope I can climb with these things with all this extra grip. I still got room too. He said if my wheel comes out of true or out of alignment, I'll still have enough room where it won't rub. So I'm hoping that's, that's the truth which I'm sure it is, but we'll see. I can't wait though to shred with this thing. Ah. 
<laughs> I just now I want to upgrade this fork. I want to upgrade the fork and the handlebars next. It, when it, once I upgrade the fork and the handlebars, I think that's that's pretty much all I want to do with this Marlin. I think the Marlin will be riding like a beast at that point. Make a beast hardtail out of this for about 15, 1600. The next thing I think I really want to do on this bike is get this fork upgraded. So if you guys have any suggestions on what kind of fork I should get on here, I might just keep the 120. If I can get a 130 on here, I will, but 120 millimeters is probably what I'll stick with. So if you guys have any suggestions, let me know. Or if you have any forks that you already have on your Marlin, that's pretty good. Let me know. I'm super excited to start the upgrade journey with this Trek Marlin 6, see what it can do. I'm excited to see what just upgrading the tires can do before I upgrade the fork. I kind of want to do it incrementally just to show you guys what it can do with each upgraded part on the bike. So we'll start with the tires, see if we can feel a difference, and then we'll go from there. But if you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video.